Welcome to Center of Math's basic series on field theory. Today we're going to uh, show the existence of fields of order, order P of n and one example of such a field. So, Uh, so we're going to prove that given any uh, any prime p and a positive integer n, we can find a field of order p of n. To do this, we're going to show uh, the roots of x to the p to the n minus x. Uh, this polynomial in uh, zp, the uh, ring of polynomials over zp. Uh, the roots of this polynomial, in fact, form our desired field. So first, we're going to note 0 is a simple root. Of this polynomial, you can factor out the x and uh, no x to the p to the n minus one minus one. Uh, zero is not a root of that. Uh, next, if a and b are ro real roots, we're going to show uh, a or roots of our polynomial. We're going to show the inverse of a is a root. A times b is a root, and a plus b is also a root. So it's closed under addition, multiplication, inverses, and uh, and subtraction and and that will show us that the elements A, B, in fact, form a field. And then the last step will just be to show that they're unique. So we have A to the P to the N minus A equals B to the P to the N minus B equals 0. Uh, say we have taking just A, P to the N minus A equals 0, we have A, P to the N equals A. Or A inverse multiplied by A, A inverse multiplied by A to the P to the N inverse of that. We get A inverse P to the N equals A inverse or a inverse also satisfies is also a root of this polynomial. Uh, take AB, AB to the P to the N is the same as A to the P to the N times B to the P to the N, which is just AB, and AB minus AB is zero, so AB is also a root. A plus B to the P to the N, if you use the, uh, if you expand this out, you'll note the bino binomial coefficients are all divisible by P except for the coefficient of a to the p to the n plus b to the p to the n. So this simplifies to a to the p to the n plus b to the p to the n. And that minus a minus b will go zero again, so a plus b is also a root. So uh, this shows the roots are closed under inverses, addition, multiplication. And so uh, now we just need to show that the roots are unique. So, w say the so each of our roots has some multiplicity. We want to show the multiplicity is in fact one. There's no, uh, yeah, there's no double, triple roots. So x minus a to the m times g of the x a is some root. We express f of x this way. We're going to make the substitution x equals y plus a. So f y plus a equals y to the m. Uh, Uh, g y plus a, but we're going to note f of y plus a, plugging into our original uh, polynomial, y plus a to the p of n using the same binomial coefficient trick, y plus a to the p of n minus y minus a will be the same as y to the p to the n minus y, which is f of y, or we have y to the m g of y plus a equals f of y, but we already noted 0 is a simple root, so m must equal 1, and so the roots must all be unique. So we can show the ring of poly polynomials over z2, uh, modulo x to the fifth plus x squared plus one, the ideal generated by uh, that polynomial is in fact a field with 32 elements. We just need to establish that x to the fifth plus x squared plus one is irreducible over z2 polynomial, polynomials in z2. Uh, so first note, plugging in zero or one, this is equal one both times, so it does not have a linear 
uh, factor. So if it is reducible, it must have a quadratic factor. And note that x squared plus x plus 1 is only irreducible uh, quadratic polynomial. If you had x squared, have solution 0, x squared plus x, solution 1, x squared uh, yeah, plus 1, have solution 1. x squared plus x plus 1, for 0 and 1, it not, does, not does not equal 0, so it does not have a linear factor. Uh, so if x to the fifth plus x squared plus 1 equals x squared plus x plus 1 times some cubic polynomial, uh, then multiplying this out, looking at the terms, we got a0 equals 1, a1 equals 1, a2 equals 1. But just from this, multiplying those out, given these, this, we get a non-zero x cubed term, which is not what we have on the left. So we do not have such a factorization on the right. And so x to the fifth plus x squared plus 1 is irreducible over this uh, ring. And so this quotient is, in fact, uh, this, yeah, this polynomial is irreducible. So this quotient is a field and has 32 elements. Uh, uh, thanks for watching. Please check out centermap.org. Check out our blog and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.